Hello, young explorer. I'm my buddy, your guide through the incredible universe of neural networks. Today, we're venturing into a city where data flows like traffic, and decisions light up like streetlights. Let's dive into the adventure. Imagine your brain is a city filled with buildings. Each building has lots of rooms, and in each room, different activities happen. Here, buildings are neurons, the basic units of a neural network, and the activities inside are like the calculations they perform. Our neural network city has three main areas, the input layer, where data enters, the hidden layers, where all the magic happens, and the output layer, where we get our answers. Let's start with the input layer. In the input layer, various types of data enter our network city. This could be anything from images and sounds to numbers and words. Think of it as the city gates where information comes in. Once inside, the data travels through hidden layers. These are like the back streets of our city, filled with numerous buildings where our data gets mixed, matched, and transformed. Each building adjusts the information using weights and biases, crucial tools that help decide the importance of incoming data. Each piece of data then goes through an activation function, kind of like a checkpoint that decides how much of the data should continue on. This process is known as propagation, where information flows forward from one layer to the next. After traveling through the hidden layers, our data reaches the output layer. Here, the final decision is made, like answering a question or recognizing a face in a photo. This is our destination. But wait! If our network makes a mistake, it needs to learn from it. This is where backpropagation comes in. It's like rewinding through the city's paths to go back and adjust those weights and biases, ensuring our network gets smarter over time. Our network is built on connections called synapses, through which data travels back and forth, learning and adjusting. It's a continuous cycle of learning, much like how you learn from your mistakes. Neural networks are everywhere. From helping self-driving cars navigate busy streets, to powering your smartphone assistants, and even learning to play games on their own. And there you have it. Our journey through the neural network city is complete. These networks might sound complex, but they're a big part of how machines learn to make our world smarter and more connected. Thanks for joining me on this adventure. Keep exploring, and who knows? Maybe one day, you'll help build even smarter neural networks. Until next time, keep learning and stay curious. More adventures with iBuddy coming soon.